Welcome to another week talk with Lady Diane. In today's talk, I wanted to tell you to surround yourself with like-minded people. Surrounding yourself with like-minded people is something that is important. And it's important in every aspect of your life, personal and professional. Like-minded people or people who share the same values as yourself. People who want the same thing in life as yourself. If you want to be successful, be around people who want to be successful. If you want to be happy, be around people who want to be happy. Because they will do everything in order to get to where they want to be. So they will inspire you to do the same thing. On a personal level, I am at a stage in my life where I just want good people around me. I want like-minded people around me. I want people who want to be the type of mother that I want to be. I want people who want to be the type of woman that I want to be. Being around like-minded people will offer you guidance and advice. It also helps you to have a different perspective on challenges. You will learn from them, but also they will push you to keep going. They help you to understand that you are not alone. Being around like-minded people allow you freedom of being who you truly are. It will help and encourage you to talk about your challenges, your feelings, without the fear of being judged. It's very important to be around people who will help you accomplish your goal instead of being with people who will distract you and discourage you. On a professional aspect, when you are with like-minded people, it will shorten your learning curve. Why? Because you will be inspired by other people, but also you will receive advice from those people. And obviously, they will teach you what not to do because they have done it before you. One thing you need to know, you are entitled to remove people who are not beneficial for your goal in your life. That doesn't mean that you have to be using people. It just means that you have to understand what it is really that you want to achieve in your life. Health-wise, emotionally, financially, when you understand what you want and you want to go for it, it's going to be a long journey. It's going to be a process. But when you are around people who want the same thing, you can only have motivation all the way there. Because remember, if you have negative people around you, people who don't want the same thing, who doesn't have the same value as yourself, when you find yourself in a position where things get hard, they aren't going to motivate you. They will tell you, I told you. I told you it's not easy. That's why I'm not doing it. I want people who can encourage me into being a better person. So I want people who are willing to be better people. That's it. When you surround yourself with like-minded people, you can only have a long-lasting relationship. Any type of relationship, it will last because you want the same thing, because you're working on getting better every single day. But when we have people around you who doesn't want the same thing, who doesn't share your values, you will change them because you get tired of them. They will get tired of you because you don't want the same thing. You know one thing I have learned? Tell me your friends and I will tell you your future. I read it somewhere and someone told me, tell me your friends and I will tell you your future. That's one thing you need to tell yourself. Tell yourself what type of, of future that you want and look for the type of people that will bring this future with you, for you. You know, sometimes you see relationship, two people live together forever and ever, have children, but deep inside, they're not happy because they just don't want the same thing. If you want to be married, you have to make sure that you are with someone who wants the same thing. If you want children and you are with someone who doesn't want children, how are you going to make this happen? Too often we are around people and we think, oh yeah, but she, he is a nice person. Yes, there's nothing wrong with someone who doesn't want the same thing as you, but what they want and what you want doesn't match. And this will become a problem. Too often I keep people around me because they're nice people, because I'm a nice person and I don't want people to feel bad. No, it's my time to be selfish. I don't want to hurt people. I don't like hurting people. So I find myself keeping around me people 
who is just not essential to my life. I'm trying my hardest to help those people. But if they don't want your help, if they're not ready for the help, you're just wasting your time and your energy when you could focus on yourself and your goals. So saying no to people, removing people around you, is not a bad thing. And that is something I struggled to understand. If the person doesn't share your values, it's a no. If the person doesn't want what you want, it's a no. Because this relationship may last for 25 years, but it's not going to help you to grow. It's not going to help you to get to where you really want to be. And you deserve to be where you want to be because you want it. So just be with people who will understand how bad you want it because they want the same thing for themselves. It's as simple as you want to diet, you want to lose weight. It's best to surround yourself with people who want to lose weight. You can't be saying to yourself, I want to eat healthy, but you're around people who are eating garbage. You can't say to yourself you want to be productive, but you are around people who only sleep all day long. It just doesn't work for you. It will drain you mentally and then it will have some aspect physically as well. And we are coming to the end of this little talk. And as usual, I love sharing whatever it is that I have learned with you. Remember, you are on a journey of self-discovery. It's not something that you're going to do overnight. It's a work in progress. You can do it. I will see you on another Will Talk with Lady Diane. Till then, remember, be you, be free.